from the station working for you. This is a WRTV update. I'm Mark Mullins bringing you the latest WRTV headlines. First responders from the Hoosier State have been deployed to help with search and rescue efforts at the condo collapse site in Florida. Around 80 members of Indiana Task Force One left for Florida Wednesday evening. This morning marks one week since the building went down suddenly. Task Force One will join hundreds of rescue workers already on scene. Nearly all COVID-19 related restrictions are now lifted in Marion County. Businesses no longer have to adhere to capacity restrictions or social distancing requirements. And masks are no longer required indoors for people who are not vaccinated. A big new attraction is coming to the Indiana State Fair. Literally, the 150 foot tall Ferris wheel will be at the fair this year. The Hoosier Cruiser Super Wheel will give patrons a bird's eye view of the fairgrounds and the city. The State Fair returns July 30th and it runs through August 22nd. I'm hearing it could be air conditioned gondolas. That's what I'm rooting for. Overnight, the chance for thunderstorms continues to increase. There's a flash flood watch because of earlier heavy rainfall. So through the overnight thunderstorms through the first half of the day, 81 your Thursday afternoon high. Friday, probably the best day in the entire seven day forecast. Temperatures around 77, low humidity, lots of sunshine, very enjoyable, a nice breeze. 80 Saturday, humidity still low, we're still dry. And then quickly, we flip the switch again. The humidity's back, 87 for the high on the 4th of July, but it's dry, still warm and dry early next week. Mark? All right, Kevin, thank you. And for more news and weather anytime, just download the WRTV mobile app.